Just saying that. Okay, I'll tell you something a little bit about myself. I like to have sex with the lights on, because my fetish is disappointment. Thank you. I don't know how to get into this, but I grew up in Oshawa. Hey! That's the right <laughs> Exactly. The amount of meth mouth I have dated is insurmountable. It's great. Oh, uh, because, oh no, I think Oshawa is interesting. Like, I've. Uh, oh, you're filming. Okay, cool. I just see a fucking flashlight in the back and it's freaking me out. Uh, it's, it's comics will understand. <laughs> no, I'll tell you, I'm from Oshawa and I, I was in a psych ward for a while. Yep, you are, right? yeah. I'm, I'm probably saying now it's an Oshawa <laughs> yeah. hospital. So uh, I, it was weird too, because they wouldn't let you outside unless you were a smoker. So I had to fake smoking. <laughs> That's always good for your sanity, right? Where they're like, why are you going outside? I'm like, nicotine. And then I would go outside and just do the but nothing's coming out. Like, luckily it was kind of winter, so you could see the breath, and I'm like, looking at the nurse that's watching everybody, like, hey, hey, come on. You know, she, she even looked at me one time, she was like, hey, you're not smoking. And I was like, I know, I just want fresh air. She's like, no, get back inside. So I took up smoking. <laughs> and then I got out of the hospital. Okay, no, I don't know. I, it, it was weird being in that, it, being in the hospital too, being in the psych ward, because I was there for like depression and hallucinations and whatnot, and like I'm a vegetarian. And this one time, the the nurse looked at me and she said, "You're schizophrenic, not vegetarian." <laughs> and I said, "You can be both." And I'm, by the way, that's her real voice. Fuck you guys if you think I'm being mean. She didn't feed me for like weeks. She thought I was on a hunger strike. She called my parents. She was like, he's not eating. They're like, what are you feeding them? They're like, me? I'm like, yeah. So, so they gave me hummus. Yeah. You ever just have hummus? Just hummus. No pita, no nan, no nothing. Just hummus. Yeah, nothing makes you feel more sane than just sticking two fingers in the dip. Just, ah, 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 ah. what are you thinking about? Not my suicide. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, speaking of sticking fingers in your mouth, do you know the uh, similarities between birds and supermodels? They're both bulimic to feed their family. <laughs> I thought that was like a nice transition, but maybe not. Uh, I'll tell you something new. I live in a, I, I'm going to college, you know, and uh, I'm living in a dorm and I have tons of anxiety, which is weird for a comedian to say, because I can talk to all of you and I'm fine. But doing my laundry is fucking crazy. Like, oh my God, there's, there's so many machines. And this one time I, I left my clothes in the dryer for too long and some asshole just took it all out and put it in a dusty pile and it was gross and it made me mad and then like weeks later someone's laundry was taking too long and I needed a machine and I was like I'm an asshole so I just took all the shit out and put it in like a dusty pile that became the thing I hated yeah that's always nice and uh, but doing that I had so much anxiety because taking someone else's laundry out of a machine imagine getting caught yes yeah. fucking Oh, I'm not stealing your laundry. I'm an asshole. You know, and you just gotta throw it in a pile or something. I don't know. I got. I was so nervous. I just did it so quick, and then just ran out quickly. You know. And then I got to my dorm, and I'm putting away my laundry, and I'm like, hey. Those aren't my Calvin Klein underwear. I'm from Oshawa. I can't afford that. So, so I'm, I'm looking at the Calvin Klein underwear and I'm like, this isn't mine. What do I do? Do I go back downstairs and try to put it in the pile? Oh my God, my anxiety rose to the top. I was like, I can't get caught doing that. You know, imagine just trying to put it back in the pile. Just like, why is my laundry over there? I don't know, but I'm not stealing it. Here you go. I'm also touching your laundry. You know, it's a, I don't know. I don't know, and then I kept putting away mine, and because it, it, it I, I'll be honest, I didn't go back downstairs. Do you, you know what I did? I threw it out. I threw someone else's, I threw laundry out that wasn't mine. Yeah, because it was easier for me to do that. I also took the garbage out immediately after, because I was like, my roommate can't see panties on top of the heap, you know? So I threw that out, and then like two minutes later, I'm putting away my laundry, and 
There's mu there's a sock and another pair. I'm like, son of a bitch! So I threw those out too. Because <laughs> I have anxiety. Alright guys, I think that's all I wanted to do. As Jesus once said, get me the hell off this thing. Thanks so much. <laughs>